sewing machine making stitches like this? Let me tell you a secret. All sewing machines, from ones that look like this to ones that look like this, ones with computers, and even ones that don't even use electricity, all make a stitch the same way. There's a top thread and a bottom or bobbin thread, and the needle takes the top thread down and makes it interlock with the bobbin thread. I'm gonna do my little demo again because TikTok took the sound away from my last video. But let's say that these are two pieces of fabric that are being held together by stitches. The needle goes down through both layers of fabric. It wraps around the bobbin or bottom thread. And if it comes back up to the top and pulls hard enough, it pulls the bobbin thread in between here. So these, this little interlocking thing is in between the two layers of fabric. And when that interlocking is in between the two layers of fabric, you can't see the other side's thread on either side. But if the top pulls too hard, then it's going to bring the bob bobbin thread up to the top, which looks like that. So if you have loops on the top like this, your needle tension is too high and you should lower it. But if the loops were on the bottom instead, that would be because the needle thread couldn't pull hard enough to pull through, so the tension is too low. And you should try raising the needle tension. But really, most of the time, you just need to re-thread your machine. Every single one of these points that the thread goes through, both on the top and in the bobbin, are very important to how the machine makes a stitch. So always recheck your threading first.